Hello Pistons fans, David Mayo from M Live here at the Palace of Auburn Hills, where tonight the Detroit Pistons are 103 to 89 losers to the Toronto Raptors. You've probably already seen that Stan Van Gundy was a little subdued in his post-game press conference. He was uh, he was not at all upset about the effort. He was not upset about the way the Pistons played tonight. And in reality, he was right to come out that way. Uh, Toronto's really good. They're the hottest team in the NBA right now. They've won 14 of their last 15 games. Uh, they shoot 55.7% from the field tonight, uh, the second hottest shooting percentage of the season for the Raptors, and the highest shooting percentage against the Pistons by any opponent this season. Just a really efficient opponent playing at its best right now. And you don't really gain anything by, by railing on the Pistons after a game, game like this. It would have been an untimely message. They have one game remaining before the All-Star break. Uh, that being Wednesday here at home against the Denver Nuggets. Uh, so it wouldn't have been well received to get on these guys about uh, defense that wasn't really that poor. It was just Toronto made shot after shot after shot. And as the Pistons pointed out, several of them after the game, any mistake they made uh, on either end of the floor, Toronto capitalized. The Pistons are really hurting right now with no Contavious Caldwell Pope. That's, that's obvious. Uh, but sometimes you have to just tip your cap to the better opponent. And uh, that was the inclination tonight by Stan Van Gundy and the Pistons as they go to 27 and 26, hang on to number eight in the East, and uh, go into to their finale before the All-Star break on Wednesday against Denver, really needing to, uh, to finish up strong before the break and go into uh, a, a, an eight-day respite. Uh, feeling good about themselves. They'll be back at it Wednesday against the Nuggets when uh, Chauncey Billups has his jersey retired here. So uh, I'll see you then again Wednesday from the Palace of Auburn Hills.